Tommy, listen to me. He is the contractor. He's the contractor, okay? I can't lose this job. I, I understand. Let, let's talk about this in the morning, okay? We'll talk about it in the morning. All right, good night. Hey. Scoot. Fun day at work, huh? What are you still doing up? It's late. Oh, crud, what time is it? It's way past your bedtime. But it's still today. Honey, please not right now. I do not have the energy for this. Here. What's this? Your birthday? You kept complaining about your broken watch. So I figured, you know. You like it? Honey, this is... It's what? nice, but I... I think it's stuck. It's not... What? No, 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 no. Oh, ha, ha. Where did you get the money for this? Drugs. I sell hardcore drugs. Oh, good. You started helping out with the mortgage then. Yeah, you wish. My daughter, I think her leg is broken. Stop right there! Okay. We're not sick. We've got a couple of civilians on the outer perimeter. Please advise. Eddie, what about Uncle Tommy? We're gonna get you to safety and go back for him, okay? Sir, there's a little girl. But... Yes, sir. Somebody we've just been through hell. Okay, we just need... Okay, baby, stay with me. I'm gonna pick you up. I know, baby, I know it hurts. Come on, baby, please. I know, baby, I know. Sarah. Baby. Don't do this to me, baby. Don't do this to me, baby. Come on. The number of confirmed deaths has passed 200. The governor has called a state of emergency. There are hundreds and hundreds of bodies lying in the streets. Panic spread worldwide after a leaked report from the World Health Organization showed that the latest vaccination tests have failed. With the bureaucrats out of power, we can finally take the necessary steps. Los Angeles is now the latest city to be placed under martial law. All residents are required to report to their designated quarantine. Riots have continued for a third consecutive day, and winter rations are at an all-time low. A group calling themselves the Fireflies have claimed responsibility for both attacks. Their public charter calls for the return of all branches of government. Demonstrations broke out following the execution of six more alleged Fireflies. Remember, when you're lost in the darkness, look for the light. Believe in the fireflies.
I'm coming. <clears throat> How was your morning? Want one? No, I don't. I want one. Well, I have some interesting news for you. Where were you, Tess? West End District. Hey, we had a drop to make. We. We had a drop to make. Well, you wanted to be left alone, remember? So I'll take one guess. The uh, whole deal went south and the client made off with our pills. Is that about <laughs> right? Deal went off without a hitch. Enough ration cards to last us a couple of months. Easy. You want to explain this? I was on my way back here, and I got jumped by these two assholes, all right? And yeah, they got a few good hits in, but... Look, I managed. Give me that. Are these assholes still with us? <laughs> well, that's funny. Can we just find out who they were? Yeah, look, they were a couple of nobodies. They don't matter. What matters is that Robert fucking sent them. Our Robert. He knows that we're after him. He figures he's gonna get us first. That son of a bitch, he's smart. No. He's not smart enough. I know where he's hiding. Like hell you do. Old warehouse in Area 5. Can't say for how long, though. Well, I'm ready now, yeah? Oh, I can do now. Well, hello, Robert. <laughs> Tess, Joel. No hard feelings, right? None at all. All right. Oh, God damn it! We missed you. Look, whatever it is you heard, it ain't true, okay? I just want to say... The guns. You want to tell us where the guns are? Yeah, sure, but... It's complicated. All right. hmm. Look, all right, just hear me out on this. I got it. <laughs> Stop, stop, stop! Oh, Quit your squirming. You were saying? I sold them. Excuse me. I didn't have much of a choice. I owed someone. You owed us. I say you bet on the wrong horse. I, I just need more time. Just, uh, give me a week. You know, I might have done that if you hadn't tried to fucking kill me. Oh, come on, it won't Who like has that. our guns? I can't. You just give me a couple of <laughs> Who has our guns? It's the fireflies. I owe the fireflies. What? Look, they're basically all dead. We can just, just go in there, finish them off. We get the guns. What do you say? Come on, yeah, fuck those fireflies. Just go get them. That is a stupid idea. Well, now what? We go get our merchandise back. How? I don't know, we explain it to them. Look, let's just go find a firefly. We won't have to look very far. Go. Queen Firefly. Why are you here? Business. You aren't looking so hot. Where's Robert? <laughs> I needed him alive. The guns he gave you, they weren't his to sell. I want them back. Doesn't work like that, Tess. The hell it doesn't. I paid for those guns. You want them back? You're gonna have to earn them. How many cards are we talking about? I don't give a damn about ration cards. I need something smuggled out of the city. You do that, I'll give you your guns back, then some. 
How do I know you got them? Way I hear the military's been wiping you guys out. Right about that. I'll show you the weapons. Search the area. Yes, sir. I gotta move. What's it gonna be? I wanna see those guns. Follow me. Let her go. Well, you're recruiting kind of young, aren't you? She's not one of mine. Oh, shit. What happened? Don't worry, this is fixable. I got his help. But I can't come with you. Well, then I'm staying. Ellie, we won't get another shot at this. Hey, we're smuggling her? There's a crew of fireflies that'll meet you at the Capitol building. That's not exactly close. You're capable. You hand her off, come back, the weapons are yours. Double what Robert sold me. Speaking of which, where are they? Back in our camp. We're not smuggling shit until I see them. You'll follow me. You can verify the weapons. I can get patched up. But she's not crossing to that part of town. I want Joel to watch over her. Whoa, whoa, I don't well, think shit, that's the I'm best not Ellie. Idea. Him? How do you know them? I was close with his brother, Tommy. Said if I was ever in a jam, I could rely on him. Was that before or after he left your little militia group? He left you too. He was a good man. I could just take her to the North Tunnel and wait for me there. Jesus Christ. It's just cargo, Joel. Marlene. No more talking. You'll be fine. <sighs> now go with him. Don't take long. And you, stay close. Let's go. Is it? <sighs> what are you doing? Killing time. Well, what am I supposed to do? I am sure you will figure that out. Your watch is broken. <laughs> you mumble in your sleep. I hate bad dreams. been this close to the outside. Look how dark it is. Can't be any worse out there. Can it? What on earth do the fireflies want with you? Hey, sorry it took so long. Soldiers fucking everywhere. How's Merlene? She'll make it. I saw the merchandise. It's a lot. Wanna do this? Yeah. Let's go. Don't do anything stupid. Move. Turn around, on your knees. When you scan them, I'll call it in. Put your hands on your head. This is Ramirez at Sector 12, requesting pickup for three stragglers. Understood. Look the other way. We can make this worth your while. Shut up. Tired of this shit. Mm -hmm. 
What's the ETA? Couple minutes. Something. Oh, shit. Look. Jesus Christ. Marlene set us up? Why the hell are we smuggling an infected girl? I'm not infected. No? Was this lying? I can explain. You better explain fast. Look at this. I don't care how you got infected. It's three weeks old. No, everyone turns within two days, so you stop bullshitting. It's three weeks, I swear. Why would she set you up? I ain't buying it. Oh, shit. Tess, run. Run! Go! Go! Move! They're gone. Look, what was the plan? Let's say that we deliver you to the Fireflies. What then? Marlene, she said that they have their own little quarantine zone. With doctors, they're still trying to find a cure. Yeah, we've heard that before, huh, Tess? And that... Whatever happened to me is the key to finding a vaccine. Oh, Jesus. It's what she said. Oh, I'm sure she did. Well, fuck you, man. I didn't ask for this. Me neither. Tess, what the hell are we doing here? What if it's true? I can't... What if, Joel? I mean, we've come this far. Let's just finish it. Do I need to remind you what is out there? I get it. Watch your step as you're going out, because it's going to be a little... <laughs> so is that everything you hoped for? Jury's still out. But oh, man, you can't deny that view. Come on, this way. Hey, let's pick it up. Look, we're almost done. Stay focused. Yes, ma'am. now what are you doing Tess oh, God. maybe they uh maybe they had a map or uh, something to tell us where they were going how far are we gonna take as this? far as it needs to go where was this lab of theirs oh, she never said she only mentioned that it was someplace out west what are we doing here this is not us what do you know about us about me I know that you are smarter than this. Really? Guess what? We're shitty people, Joel. It's been that way for a long time. No, we are survivors. This is our chance. It is over, Tess! Now, we tried. Let's just go home. I'm not... I'm not going anywhere. This is my last stop. What? Our luck had to run out sooner or later. Are you going on... No, don't! Don't touch me. Holy shit. She's infected. <laughs> Joel. Let me see. I didn't mean for this. Show it to me. Oh, Christ. 
Christ. <laughs> Oops, right? Give me your arm. This was three weeks. I was bitten an hour ago and it's already worse. This is fucking real, Joel. You've got to get this girl to Tommy's. He used to run with this crew. He'll know where to go. No, 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 no. That was your crusade. I am not doing that. Yes, you are. Look, there's enough here that you have to feel some sort of obligation to me so you get her to Tommy's. They're here. Damn it. I can buy you some time, but you have to run. You want us to just leave you here? Yes. There is no way that- I will not turn into one of those things. Come on. Make this easy for me. I can find- No, no, just go! Just fucking go. Ellie. I'm sorry, I didn't, I didn't mean for this. Get a move on. Hey, look, um, about Tess, I, I don't even know what Here's how this thing's gonna play out. You don't bring up Tess, ever. Matter of fact, we just keep our histories to ourselves. Secondly, don't tell anybody about your condition. They think you're crazy, they'll try to kill you. And lastly, you do what I say when I say it. We clear? Sure. Repeat it. What you say goes. Good. Uh, now there's a town a few miles north of here. There's a fella there that owes me some favors. Good chance he could get us a car. Okay. Let's get a move on. and all. Uh, Ellie. Hey, what are you, Joel? Bill. What are you doing? Bill, <laughs> turn around and get on your knees. Just calm down a second. Turn around all right. and get on your knees. Uh, Don't test me. Just take it easy. Uh, any bites? No. Anything sprouting? Oh, God damn it, I'm clean. Don't I see so much as a drug. Uh, Ow! Stop! Son of a bitch! You done? Am I done? You come into my house. You set off all my traps. You damn near break my shooting arm. Who the fuck is this punk and what's she doing here? I am none of your goddamn business. And we're here because you owe Joel some favors. And oh. you can start by taking these off. I owe Joel some favors. It's some kind of joke. I'll cut to the chase. I need a car. Well, it is a joke. Joel needs a car. Well, if I had one that works, which I sure as hell don't, what makes you think I'd just give it to you? Huh? Yeah, sure, Joel, go ahead, take my car. Take all my food, too, while you're at it. By the looks of it, you could lose some of that food. You listen to me, you little shit. No, fuck you, you handcuff me. I him. need you to shut up, all right? Whatever favors you think I owe you ain't worth that much. Actually, Bill, they are. Well, it don't matter, because I don't have a car that works. But there is one in this town. Parts. There are parts in this town. Meaning that you could fix one up. All right. If I'm going to do this, there's some gear I'm going to need. All right. It's on the other side of town. Now, you help me go gather it, and maybe I can put something together that runs. But after this, I owe you nothing. That's fine. 
A couple of days from now, we'll probably be dead anyway. Good. Follow me. Whole goddamn town's booby trapped. Best stay right on my ass. Can't miss it. Knock it off. Well, here we are. You don't touch anything. And you close the door. Let's gear up. Uh-uh. What? I need a gun. No, you don't. Joel, I can handle myself. No. Just stay here. It's fine. Just wait around for you two to get me killed. Well, this goes on record as the worst fucking job you've ever taken. Hey, it's up there. How in the hell is Tess okay with this suicide mission? It's actually her idea. Really? Well, the broad's not as smart as I thought she was. What? Fuck her. Seriously, you gotta take that kid back to where you found her. I can't just take her back. Then send her packing, let her find her own way. Look, let me tell you a story. Once upon a time, I had somebody that I cared about. A partner. Somebody I had to look after. And in this world, that sort of shit's good for one thing. Getting you killed. So you know what I did? I wasn't the fuck up. And I realized it's gotta be just me. Bill, it ain't, it ain't like that. It's bullshit. It is just like that. Hey! What'd I say to you when we walked down the steps? What'd I say? I'm just fixing your stupid pile. Don't touch. God damn it. You keep babysitting long enough, and eventually it's gonna blow up in Bill, your face. Can we please just get on with it? Here, let's get on with it. That's not gonna hold. We'll make it fast. Grab this. Please tell me you're done! It's empty. What? Fucking empty! Guys! Bill, where to? Uh, Bill, where? Anywhere but here. You're ready to haul ass. Come on. They've broken through. Inside the house now. So that worked out well. Okay, uh... I'll go check out this side of the house. Bill? Somebody had the same idea they stole my shit. Well, then what the hell is plan B? You ought to be thankful you're still drawing breath. That was plan A, B, C, all the way to fucking Z. And furthermore, tell Tess that she could take Don't this job. Don't you bring Tess she into this. Shove it right it has up nothing to do with... Jesus. What, you know this guy or something? Frank. Who the hell's Frank? He was my partner. He's the only idiot that would wear a shirt like that. He's got bites. Here. And... Reckon he didn't want to turn, so he... Yeah, I guess not. Well, fuck him. Look what I found. It's got some juice in it. That's my battery. That fucking <laughs> asshole. Get out. Get out. Okay. Jeez. Batteries drain, but cells are alive. Meaning? Meaning we push it, get it started, and the alternator will recharge the battery. 
Is that your guess? Look, you wanted a plan B. This is as good as it gets. What are you thinking? I'm thinking you drive and we push. All right, this'll do! Stop! Just keep it running, all right? That girl nearly got us killed. You gotta admit, she did hold her own back there. <laughs> you ain't gonna make it. Oh, oh. Uh... Here. What's this? You'd be amazed at how many cars still got gas in them. Appreciate it. Look, Bill, uh, about your buddy back there, uh, that's a tough deal. And I'm, uh... We square. We're square. And get the fuck out of my town. Happened to sleeping. Okay, I know it doesn't look like it, but this here is not a bad read. Only one problem. Right there. To be continued. I hate cliffhangers. Where did you get that? Uh, back at Bill's. I mean, all this stuff was just lying there. <sighs> what else did you get? Well, here. This make you all nostalgic? You know, that is actually before my time. <laughs> that is winter, though. your seatbelt on, Ellie. Well, well, what about the guy? Well, he ain't even hurt. the hell out of that guy, huh? Yeah, you sure did. I feel sick. And you just hang back like I told you to. Well, you're glad I didn't, right? I'm glad I didn't get my head blown off by a goddamn kid. You know what? No. How about, hey, Ellie, I, I know it wasn't easy, but it was either him or me. Thanks for saving my ass. You got anything like that for me, Joel? We gotta get going. Lead the way. Oh, shit. Come here, keep your head down. All right now, I'm gonna jump down there and I'm gonna clear us a path. What about me? You stay here. This is so stupid. We'd have more of a fucking chance if you let me help. I am. You seem to know your way around a gun. You reckon you can handle that? Well, I sort of shot a rifle before, but it was at rats. Rats? With BBs. Well, 
It's the same basic concept. Lift it up. All right, now. You're going to lean right into that stock, because it is going to kick a hell of a lot more than any baby rifle. Okay. Go ahead and pull the bolt back. Grab it right there. Just tug it. Here you go. And as soon as you fire, you're going to want to get another round in there quick. Listen to me. If I get into trouble down there, you make every shot count. Yeah. I got this. All right. And just so we're clear about back there, it was either him or me. You're welcome. I do. How about something uh, a little more your size? It's for emergencies only. Okay. Take it easy. It's all right. They're not the bad guys. A little lower the gun. Man, you hit hard. Yeah, well, I was <laughs> trying to kill you. Yeah, I thought you were one of them, too. Then I saw you. If you haven't noticed, they don't keep kids around. Survival of the fittest. You're bleeding. Ah, it's, it's nothing. I'm Henry. This is Sam. I think I caught your name was Joel. Ellie. How many are with you? They're all dead. Hey, we don't know that. There were a bunch of us. Someone had the brilliant idea of entering the city, look for supplies. Those fuckers, they ambushed us, <clears throat> scattered us. Now it's all about getting out of this shithole. We can help each other. Ellie. Safety in numbers and all that. She's right. We could help each other. We got a hideout not too far from here. Be safer if we chat there. All right, take us there. Welcome to my office. How long have you guys been holed up in here? A few days. We found a bit of food, though. Here. Blueberries. Found a whole stash of them. You want some? No. Hey, man, relax. We're safe. So why haven't you left? Been waiting for the right opportunity. And? Here. Check this out. Look at these sons of bitches. Every day they congregate down there, guarding that damn bridge. Come nighttime, it's down to a skeleton crew. After sunset, that's our window. Most of them gone, sneak right past them. That could work. No, oh, it'll work. It'll definitely work. <laughs> wow. Oh All right, ready? Oh. Ow! <laughs> a blueberry hurt you? It's been a while since that boy even cracked a smile. 
She doesn't seem bothered by all this. So where were you heading? I heard the Fireflies are based out west somewhere. We're gonna join up with them. Something funny? Oh, it just seems like there's a lot of people putting their stock on the Fireflies these days. Yeah, maybe there's a reason for that. So you don't know where they are, and you're just gonna drag him across the country to find them? I tell you what, how about I worry about my brother, you worry about your girl. Easy. We're looking for the Fireflies, too. This is us. There's an abandoned military radio station just outside the city. Any survivors from our group, they're supposed to meet us there tomorrow. You and your girl, you want to join us. It goes down tonight. I guess we best rest up then. He says it's time to go. You know, we're gonna be moving fast, okay? So no matter what, you stick to me like glue. Like glue. Like glue. Got it. Good, good. All right, y'all ready? Yeah. Okay. Fuck! How many bullets do you have left? Kill us! What other choice do we have? We jump! No, it's too high and you can't swim. I'll boost you up, you run past them. You keep me afloat! Ellie! No time to argue! Ellie! Uh. Damn it! Henry, he's awake. Hey, you. We're alive. <laughs> okay. See? What'd I tell you, huh? He's good. Everything's fine. <laughs> you know, Sam's the one who spotted you. You guys are taking quite a bit of water. What's wrong with you? Henry! Get back, hey, Sean! Hey, hey, hey. He's pissed, but he's not gonna do anything. You sure about that? Stop! Joel? He left us to die out there. No. You had a good chance of making it, and you did. Coming back for you. I mean, putting him at risk. Stay back. If it was the other way around, would you have come back for us? I saved you. He saved me too. We would have drowned. It's fine, Liz. I'm okay. You know, for what it's worth, I'm really glad we spotted you. Now, that radio tower, it's on the other side of this cliff. Okay? Place is gonna be full of supplies. You're gonna be really happy you didn't kill me. You're okay. I'm still in here. Anybody hurt? Uh-uh. No, we're good. I think it's time we quit this place. Come on. Let's go. Shut the hell up. That's serious. It was Tommy's birthday, and that's all he wanted to do is just rent two Harleys and drive cross country. Oh, man. I could die happy if I could just ride one around the block. <laughs> <laughs> what was it like? It was good. It was real good. Good? Can, can you believe this guy? Come on, man, give me details. Describe it. <laughs> you know what? You two deserve a little privacy. No, no, Ellie, Ellie. This isn't just any regular motorcycle, okay? You get on that bad boy, you feel that engine? Nothing like it. 
Oh, yeah? How would you know? Seen it in my dreams. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I don't think anyone from my group is gonna show up. Yeah. Worst part about it all, explaining to Sam. Well, it's safe to say those two have officially bonded. What are you doing? Taking stock of all the food we found today. I see. And how are we doing on canned peaches? Did Henry send you? No. Why would Henry send me? To make sure I'm not fucking up somehow. I'd say we all did pretty good back there. Especially you. Is everything all right? Yeah, everything's fine. Okay. Well, have a good night. How is it that you're never scared? Who says that I'm not? What are you scared of? Uh, let's see. Scorpions are pretty creepy. Uh, being by myself. I'm scared of ending up alone. What about you? Those things out there. What if the people are still inside? What if they're trapped in there without any control of their body? Scared of that happening to me. Okay. First of all, we're a team now. Okay, we're gonna help each other out. And second, they might still look like people, but that person is not in there anymore. Yeah, Henry says that they've moved on, that they're with their families, like in heaven. Do you think that's true? I go back and forth. I mean, I'd like to believe it. But you don't. I guess not. Yeah, me neither. Oh, all the serious talk, I almost forgot. There, if he doesn't know about it, can't take it away. All right, I'm pooped. I'll see you tomorrow. That smells good. Good morning. Where's Sam? I let him sleep in for once. Oh. Well, if you want him to join us, you can go wake his ass up. Okay. Sam? <laughs> Sam! What the hell? <laughs> Shit, he's turning! <laughs> That's my fucking brother! <laughs> Screw it! <laughs> Shit! Really? Gotta go, you're right. Uh -huh. Oh my god. Sam? Oh no. Sam? Henry? <gasps> Gotta stay there. Henry? What have you done? I'm gonna get that gun from me, okay? 
Whoa, okay, okay, easy. It's your fault. This is nobody's fault, Henry. It's all your fault. Henry. Henry, no. <laughs> Don't even think about reaching for your weapon. Tell the girl to drop hers now. Ellie, do as the lady says. Okay. Please tell me you're lost. Oh, we didn't know the place was occupied. We're just trying to make our way through. Through to where? They're all right. But you know these people? I know him. He's my goddamn brother. Tommy. Holy shit. What are you doing, baby brother? God damn. Yeah. Let me look at you. You get fucking old. Easy. It's going to happen to you, too. This is Maria. Be nice to her. She sort of runs things around here. Ma'am, thanks for not blowing my head off. Would have been embarrassing, considering you're my brother-in-law. We all gotta get wrangled up at some point. Well, Ellie, right? Yeah. What brings you through here? Uh, that's kind of a long story. Why don't we bring him inside? Yeah. You hungry? Starving. Quite the crew you got here. Yeah, they're good men. This place gives them a second chance. Gives us all a second chance. So why'd you leave Boston? I've been on quite the adventure, little brother. I reckon it's got something to do with that girl. <laughs> it's got everything to do with that little girl. Well, go on then. She's immune. Immune to what? Oh, come her, on. I know I've seen her breathe enough spores to take down a dozen men. And nothing. Now, I wouldn't have believed it neither. But I can show you. All right. I'll bite. Why bring her here? I was supposed to deliver to the Fireflies. The way I figure they're your boys. <laughs> You finish the job, you collect the whole damn payment. I haven't seen a firefly in years. But you know where they are. Now, I'm not asking for much, Tommy. I just want some simple gear, enough to set me on my way. What makes you think I'd do this for you? This isn't for me, Tommy. This is for your damn cause. My cause is my family now. You ain't talking about some walk in the park here. Jesus, boy. Have Maria get some of your born-again friends to do it. They got I... families, too. Tommy, I need this. You want some gear? Sure. But I ain't taking that girl off your hands. This is how you gonna repay me, huh? Repay you? For all those goddamn years I took care of us. Took care? That's what you call it? I got nothing but nightmares from those years. You survived because of me! It wasn't worth it. I bring you the cure from mankind, and you wanna play the pissy little brother? We ain't back in Boston. You lay your hands on me again, it won't end well for you. The hell is that? We're under attack. You still remember how to kill, right? Yeah. You okay? Yeah, 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 I'm fine. Oh, oh man. They were coming in from every direction, and Maria was like, we gotta run, and so we dove over these tables, and this huge guy blasted with a shotgun. Slow down, slow down, slow down. Listen, then... hey, hey, are you hurt? No. God damn it. I need to talk to you. 
Absolutely not. You tell him to go find somebody else. Maria, I can't have this hanging over my head. Do you have any idea how many men we lost here today? Hey, what's that all about? Does that have anything to do with me? We'll talk about it later. Did he tell you where the lab is? We'll talk about it later. Later. Right. It takes one. One fuck up. One fuck up and then I turn into one of those widows, okay? I have to do this. I don't know what else to say. Fine. Maria. Maria. Here we go. You. If anything, anything at all happens to him, it's on you. She's thankful, you know. Yeah, I know. I'll take that girl of yours to the Fireflies. You don't have to worry about it. It's best this way. Well, maybe some real good will come of this. I need to talk to Ellie. Say again, I didn't hear you. Joe! What, what is it? That girl of yours, she took one of our horses and rode off. Damn it, which way? Come on. Is this really all they had to worry about? Boys, movies, deciding which shirt goes with which skirt. It's bizarre. Get up, we're leaving. Come on. And if I say no? Do you even realize what your life means? Huh? Running off like that, putting yourself at risk? It's pretty goddamn stupid. Well, I guess we're both disappointed with each other then. What do you want from me? Admit that you wanted to get rid of me the whole time. Tommy knows this area. Oh, better fuck than... that. Well, I'm sorry. I trust him better than I trust myself. Stop with the bullshit. What are you so afraid of? That I'm gonna end up like Sam? I can't get infected. I can take care of myself. How many close calls have we had? Well, we seem to be doing all right so far. And now you'll be doing even better with Tommy. Not her, you know. What? Maria told me about Sarah. Ellie? And... You are treading on some mighty thin ice here. I'm sorry about your daughter, Joel, but I have lost people too. You have no idea what loss is. Everyone I have cared for has either died or left me. Everyone fucking except for you. So don't tell me that I would be safer with someone else because the truth is I would just be more scared. Together, we're not alone. I got two walking. There's more inside already. We're clear.
There she is. Kids will be watching movies tonight. Where is this lab of theirs? It's all the way out, University of Eastern Colorado. Go bighorns. <laughs> Ellie, get off your horse. Give it on back to Tommy. I'm gonna hang on to this fella. That's all right with you. Go on, don't make me repeat myself. What are you doing? Your wife kind of scares me. <laughs> I don't want her coming after you. Sorry for stealing your horse. Look, come back to town. Let's discuss it at least. You know me, my mind's all made up. University, Eastern Colorado. How do I find this lab? It's in the science building. Looks like a giant mirror, and you can't miss it. You take care of that wife of yours. There's a place for you here, you know? You good? I'm good. Adios, little brother. Yeah, no shit. I'm dead. Or I will be soon. Got me some time to reflect. Been years that felt like we were... The fucking thing was a giant waste of time. I'm not gonna do this anymore. Come on. Looking for the others. They've all returned to St. Mary's Hospital in Salt Lake City. You'll find them there. Still trying to save the world. Do you know where that is? I know the city. Is it far? It ain't close. I mean, on horseback. What? Fireflies? Get down! <laughs> oh! I think we're safe. Joel? Joel? <laughs> Shit. Joel! won't last very long. You'll just startle it. Who's there? Hello? We just want to talk. Any sudden moves and I put one right between your eyes. Ditto for Buddy Boy over there. What do you want? Um, name's David. This here's my friend James. We're from a larger group. Women, children. We're all very, very hungry. So am I. Women and children, all very hungry too. Well, uh, maybe we could, uh, Trade you for some of that meat there. What do you need? Weapons, ammo, clothes. Medicine. You have any antibiotics? We do. Back at the camp. You're welcome to follow us. I'm back. not following you anywhere. 
Buddy boy can go get it. He comes back with what I need. The deer is all yours. Anyone else shows up... You put one right between my eyes. That's right. Two bottles of the penicillin in a syringe. Make it fast. Go on. I'll take that rifle. Of course. Back up. Probably gonna be a while. You, uh, mind if we take some shelter from the cold? Bring him with us. shouldn't be out here all on your own. I don't like company. I see. What's your name? Why? Look, I understand it's not easy to trust a couple of strangers. Whoever's heard, you clearly care about them. I'm sure it's gonna be just fine. We'll see. gun? Sorry. Hey, I really like my rifle back now. No, you have your pistol. Hope you know how to use that thing. I've had some practice. <sighs> well, you handled yourself pretty nice back there. <laughs> I'd say we make a pretty good team. We got lucky. Lucky? No, no. No such thing as luck. Now, you see, I believe that everything happens for a reason. Sure. I do. And I can prove it to you. Now, this winter, that's been especially cruel. Now, a few weeks back, I uh, sent a group of men out a nearby town to look for food. Only a few came back. He said that the others had been uh, slaughtered by a crazy man. And get this, he's a crazy man traveling with a little girl. You see, everything happens for a reason. Uh, don't get upset. It's not your fault. I'm just a kid. James, lower the gun. No way, David. I'm not gonna let her lower go. Lower the gun. Now give her the medicine. The others won't be happy about this. Yeah, well, that's not your concern. Move the fuck out of the way. You won't survive long out there. I can't protect you. Oh, thanks. Get out of here.
Joel? Oh. I only managed to get a little bit of food. <laughs> but I did get this. Move your arm. I'm gonna draw them away from here. I'll come back for you. Oh. Oh. How are you feeling? Super. Here. You should eat. I know you're hungry. You've been out for quite some time. What is it? It's deer. With some human helping on the side? I promise, it's just the deer meat. You're a fucking animal. Well, it's awfully quick to judgment. Considering you and your friend killed how many men? They didn't give us a choice. And you think we have a choice, is that it? You kill to survive, and so do we. We have to take care of our own, by any means necessary. So now what? You gonna chop me up into tiny pieces? <laughs> I'd rather not. Please tell me your name. You're so full of shit. On the contrary, I've been, uh, Quite honest with you. Now I think it's your turn. It's the only way I'm gonna be able to convince the others. Convince them of what? That you can come around. You have heart. You're loyal. And you're special. Oh. What am I supposed to tell the others now? Ellie. 
What? Tell them that Ellie is the little girl that broke your fucking finger. How did you put it? Hmm? Tiny pieces. See you in the morning, Ellie. Girl. <laughs> Fuck! Focus right here, right here. And I'll pop your goddamn knee off. The girl. She's alive. She's David's newest pet. Where? In the town. In the town. But you're gonna mark it on the map. And it better be the same exact spot your buddy points to. Mark it. It's right there. You can verify it. Go ask him. Go on. I tell you, I ain't lying. I ain't. <laughs> It's all right. I believe him. No, wait! Wakey, wakey. Come on. Let's go! Stop! I warned you. Happens for a reason, right? What the hell is that? She would have turned by now. It can't be real. Looks pretty fucking real to me. We don't have to do this. You know that, right? 
What's the other option? Go back to Tommy's. Just be done with this whole damn thing. After all we've been through. Everything that I've done. It can't be for nothing. Welcome to the Fireflies. Sorry about the... They didn't know who you were. And Ellie? She's all right. They brought her back. <sighs> you came all this way. How'd you do it? It was her. <clears throat> she fought like hell to get here. Maybe it was meant to be. <clears throat> I lost most of my crew across in the country. I pretty much lost everything. And then you show up, and somehow we find you just in time to save her. Maybe it was meant to be. Take me to her. You don't have to worry about her anymore. We'll take care I of her. I worry. Just let me see her, please. You can't. She's being prepped for surgery. The hell you mean, surgery? The doctors tell me the cordyceps, the growth inside her, has somehow mutated. It's why she's immune. Once they remove it, they'll be able to reverse engineer a vaccine. A vaccine. But it grows all over the brain. It does. Find someone else. There is no one else. Listen, you were gonna show me where's... Stop. I get it. But whatever it is you think you're going through right now is nothing to what I have been through. I knew her since she was born. I promised your mother I would look after her. Then why are you letting this happen? Because this isn't about me, or even her. There is no other choice here. March him out of here. He tries anything, shoot him. Don't waste this gift, Joe. Get up. I said get up. Keep walking. <laughs> <laughs> 
Where was the operating room? I ain't got time for this. Where? Where? Top floor, the far end. She won't feel anything. are still wearing off. What happened? We found the fireflies. Turns out there's a whole lot more like you, Ellie. People that are immune. There's dozens, actually. I ain't done them a damn bit of good, neither. They've actually... They've stopped looking for a cure. I'm taking us home. I'm sorry. Come on. Hey, wait. <sighs> Back in Boston? Back when I was bitten? I wasn't alone. My best friend was there. And she got bit, too. We didn't know what to do. So... She says... Let's just wait it out. You know, we can be all poetic and just lose our minds together. I'm still waiting for my turn. Ellie. Her name was Riley, and she was the first to die. And then it was Tess. And then Sam. None of that is on you. You don't understand. I struggled for a long time with surviving. And you... No matter what... You keep finding something to fight for. Now, I know that's not what you want to hear right now. Swear though, to me. Swear to me that everything that you've said about the Fireflies is true. I swear.